How's it going, Phone Lab? It's Rude Junkie here. Today's video, we're going to be talking about the Lenovo Zook Z2. And what we're going to be discussing specifically is how to use different boot modes on this device. So to do that, you obviously have to power the device off so that we can go ahead and utilize these different boot modes. Um, and you're going to need to have a USB cable and you're going to need to have it plugged into your computer. Basically, plugging in the USB cable and holding certain buttons is what triggers most of the modes we're going to access. And so you, you just got to be, be prepared for that. This is USB Type-C, by the way, but it doesn't make a difference um, as long as you have the right cable for your specific device. So what we're going to do is we're going to hold volume up and volume down and then plug in the cable. And what this does is this boots us into bootloader mode. You can unplug the cable now and we'll turn around and look at, look at it. So this is bootloader mode. In bootloader mode, you have a bunch of options. You can see them on the top. And um, you just use your volume up and down to scroll. Okay, so power off, restart, which would turn on the device, boot it up. Um, fast boot mode, which is actually what we're in here, bootloader mode slash fast boot mode. Uh, recovery mode and off. So we're actually going to go to um, recovery mode. Let me show you how to do that. So you want to select any mode, you just hit the power button to select it. And you'll see recovery mode. Now, this menu will not be here unless you have an unlocked bootloader. This device is unlocked, and so that's why it's showing that menu there. But this will show you the um, recovery. Recovery is super limited, at least in this version. Yours might vary a little bit here. It just says main menu. Basically, you have reboot. You have install update package, which hopefully we'll get into a video on that soon. And then you have power off. Those are your options. Very simple. You can even wipe data factor reset here in recovery, um, which is a little bit annoying, honestly. It kind of bothers me. Um, so you've got that mode. And then you've got another mode. This mode is Qualcomm mode. And it's a little bit tricky to get into, especially with a locked bootloader. If your bootloader is unlocked, it's actually very easy. Um, you just hold volume down and you plug in the cable. Now, that's not going to work for us because we have an unlocked bootloader. So let me see if I can do it. So we're going to plug in the cable. And you see this menu. Just hit power and hit volume down. And see if it, let's see if it works. It might. It did. Okay. So this is the Qualcomm mode. Now, in here, you can do a bunch of things as well. So your options here are SD update, which would be an update from the SD card, just like you can do in recovery. Here you can restore your um, QCN. You can save your PERMA. You can reboot. You can shut down. You can get info. Get info doesn't really do anything on this screen. I'm going to show you. So there's, you can, again, use power to select, or you can use the on-screen button. So we'll do get info, getting device info done. I don't really know what that exactly does. Um, probably maybe something within uh, the Qualcomm uh, if you're using the QFill, which you're going to see in some later videos. So this mode is very important because when you're plugged in in this mode, you can actually utilize um, ADB. And if you plug the device in in this mode to your computer and pull up your command window, you can actually type in ADB reboot EDL. And that will reboot you into your bulk mode, Qualcomm mode, which is uh, 9008. And once you're in that mode, you can utilize and use QFill to flash the device. Full firmware restore, hard brick restore, very, very nice feature to have. And we're going to do a video on that. So, But here you go, guys. That's basically your menus at this point. I'm going to go ahead and hit uh, power to shut down. And uh, we'll reboot the device, and there you go. So now you know how to utilize them. Some of these you can get to from here. If you have an unlocked bootloader, you can hit volume on boot, only if you have an unlocked bootloader. And now you can actually access these right here without even plugging in a cable. So these options are available here as well. You know, do what you want to do, but um, I kind of like that they're available there with the unlocked bootloader, but they're not necessary. Um, and this screen will not be here if you, unless you have an unlocked bootloader. It'll normally just be this. And you'll have to use your button combinations and your USB cable to uh, boot into any mode that you specifically need. Um, the Qualcomm bulk mode, bulk mode is probably the best mode you're going to need to know how to utilize and fast boot and booting into the bootloader. So, but there you go. That's going to be the video here on different boot modes on the Lenovo Zook Z2. And you can utilize um, this on other Lenovo devices as well. This variants will be a little bit in the recovery menu and... Um, you know, different things there. You might see a little bit of variance there, but, and some, some of the LG devices are going to have what looks like stock Android recovery, which you've seen on most devices and not this specific version. 
But there you go. I hope you've enjoyed the video. Stay tuned for more stuff here on Lenovo and this device, and we'll catch you in the next one. Root Junkie out.